Mr. Truck here. I'm at the NFR 2013 in Las Vegas. We're at the Cowboy Christmas, and I'm visiting here with Abby Clark of Signature Conversions. Mr. Truck here, I'm um, visiting with Abby Clark. She's the big cheese at <laughs> Signature, <laughs> Signature Living Quarters. And uh, we're gonna look at her trailer, we're gonna to go to the factory and visit it. And we're gonna cover some of the, the cool points you have here. And this one is in Vegas at the NFR. And it's a, oh, it's a beautiful trailer. You have so many features in here. And this is like a luxury condo. I know there's, it's fun to get, to come to shows like uh, the NFR because you get to hear the oohs and ahs when people walk in, oh, this is nicer than my home, you know? <laughs> so it is it is a lot of fun to, to get that feedback, but it is, it's got all the amenities of a home, really. Well, yeah, you're not giving up anything being on the road. That is so nice. I mean, you, yep. know, you know, working with horses and all that, just having a shower on the road tickles me to death. Yeah. But to have it, you know, is, is nicer and nicer than some houses are, it's... Uh, it certainly makes uh, takes luxury to a new level. You've got great living quarters, horse traders. You kind of run the high end of things as far as quality. Uh, what makes your conversion different? I think really that attention to detail and the customization for our customers. Um, we really work hand in hand with them, the end user, to get exactly what they want in these. Awesome, and I'm sure you've got a whole list of options and you can do them about any size of trailer. Absolutely. And you have several packages or you just custom design every every living quarters? You know, either whether it's a dealer inventory unit or right with the customer, it, it kind of starts with a floor plan and um, getting what that dealer or customer wants to see. And then from there, um, my specialty is the, the interior design work and I take my samples and Start creating. <laughs> awesome. So you're a designer. Yeah. Well, that's awesome. They, these are great looking trailers. Uh, I know you sell to whoever whoever has one. You can sell them to the public. You can sell them to dealers. So you're not locked into a particular brand. I know you like uh, you, you work with a lot of the higher end brands. Yep. We work with several brands in the industry as well. Our dealers sell many different brands. So we're not locked in. When these trailers come to us, they're a complete uh, bare aluminum shell and, and we start. So we don't necessarily um, care what what kind of a trailer you put it in. We're we're more interested in what's going on up here. Well, awesome! I, I know you're in Nebraska now. Does that mean that your trailers are more insulated for the cold, or you know? I do. Uh, I do believe we have one of the best insulation packages in the industry, and that is probably a prime reason is because a lot of our units stay up where it's cold, yeah. and our customers stay in them year-round, and so they have to. To be able to to meet uh, temperatures, you know, in below zeros. Uh, oh, yeah. When I left, I, I left and came to Las Vegas, but back home it was negative 22. So <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's very cold. Yes. I'm in Colorado. We were minus 12 last week. But yeah, 22. That's I would be, just not fun. <laughs> yeah, that's not fun at all. Well, that's awesome. So people living year-round, because you know, a lot of traders aren't built for year-round use, and you know, even the RV industry is having trouble in that area. It's nice to see that you make one that you can just stay in, and you know, nothing will freeze on it, and it'll be a usable trailer. Yeah, we actually just sold one this week and, and it's uh, a customer in Colorado and what we're going to do there is actually build the floor up and all the plumbing and all the tanks will be inside the, the chassis and so nothing can freeze. It'll all be heated, it'll the it'll have in-floor heat basically to keep everything running and warm. Well that's awesome. Well, does that elevate the floor or does that... It does elevate it. Um, well that's a good thing because that makes it a little shorter step into the into bedroom. The nose. Yeah, there I you like go. that idea. That's very good. <laughs> I, I'm an old and I don't like climbing climb too many stairs. <laughs> no, that sounds really good. So you have a lot of options. You have dealers in several states. It looks like uh, you're on your road. Do you know How long have you folks been in business? We are headed into our eighth year. So, it means you weren't rocking through. and rolling. Yes. yes, you walked right through the recession and survived. That's, yes. that's always a good point, too. Well, that's great. So, I want to come to your factory and watch them be built and see what I can learn there. Absolutely. Uh, but this is an awesome trailer. Well, thanks for visiting with us. You're welcome. Hi, it's Mr. Truck again. I'm here with Darwin Hargrave with Signature Conversions. Darwin, how's yes, the show going? Wonderful. We're having a great show. Well, that's great. I see you around the country, different horse shows. Yes, sir. I've seen you at Kansas, seen you at several places. You got an awesome living quarters. Thank you. Can you give me more of the details of the mechanics? I mean, what makes you special under the skin? 
you know, we really focus on our cabinetry. We've got a cabinet shop that I would put up against anybody in the nation as far as the attention to detail, the craftsmanship, the skilled labor we use. Um, behind the scenes, there's a lot of things that our customers can't see. They walk into this trailer, and like you said, um, our shop's producing a, a beautiful product. Mm -hmm. But there are features behind the scenes, our insulation processes, our construction processes that give us a little bit of an edge over the competition that nobody else uses. Awesome. Well, having your own cabinet shop, I mean, that's a great thing. You can reach, you can change design, you can Absolutely. upgrade things. Um, we focus, again, our kind of our claim to fame is our cabinet shop. Um, our parent company is a custom home builder. Oh. So we can bring that residential feel into the living quarter market for the horse trailers. Uh, allows us a lot in design work as well as the construction. Um, but at the same time, we do focus on things like weight of trailers. These trailers are getting so much bigger, so much longer. Not everybody wants to buy the big trucks anymore. So we really yeah. pay attention to what the customers are requesting there and what they're looking for. And we look at ways of cutting weight without cutting quality. Well, that's good. Yeah, that's that's very true. People are, are more conscious about you know, miles per gallon and all Absolutely. that. Absolutely. So Absolutely. You, you, if you're carrying a boat behind you, it gets kind of expensive. Right. Well, that's awesome. That um, uh, is there anything special about the wiring? Or I know you tell me any trade secrets, but no, is actually, it a system, um, or like an automotive, or what is it? It's very similar, and uh, you know, it's pretty uniform throughout the industry. Uh, we are all governed by agencies that make sure we do it to codes and specs, and they've got fairly strict guidelines. So we pretty much just follow those guidelines, and um, they tell us the safest, best way to do it. Yeah. How about how your water tanks? Are they pretty secure? I mean, oh, absolutely. I was worried about the no. black and gray tanks. No, absolutely. And what we do, uh, kind of on that note, is everything, of course, is secure, but we go through a series of checks. There's a lot of appliances in the Strader refrigerators, TVs, satellites, things like that, that we, we obviously buy. Um, and we have a series of checks that we go through, um, and not a trade secret here, but you know, we check each appliance or each product before we install it. We check it as we install it, then we do two or three checks throughout the process of the trailer, and then a final check to make sure everything works. You know, our main goal is when the customer purchases this trailer, they don't just get the look and the feel, they get a product that works, it stands up to the test of time, and they can use it day in and day out without having any phone calls. Well, that's awesome because that's the two things I worry about is the water tanks and the electrics. Yeah, absolutely. All the wiring, all that stuff. Absolutely. So if you make it easy, make it easy to troubleshoot, make it easy to check, I like that. You bet, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, that's awesome. Yeah, Abby was saying you guys do like a water check uh, on the on the shell or on the trailer. Absolutely, the, the check for for sealed links. That's really good. I mean, I know the RV industry does that on the top end. Right, and right. Of course, automotive does it. So, but right. that's a big thing. I mean, I see a lot of horse trailers with water leaks. You bet. And, well, yeah. And, it's with that, the first thing we do when we pull it in the shop, we do an exterior water leak to make sure nothing is getting in before we put the walls insulation. Um, soft touch all that stuff on we want to make sure if there is an issue or if there it could be a problem we're going to stop it before it happens and then again when we go through and as we're putting water tanks in and water heaters in and appliances in we do another series of checks well that's awesome and yeah I like that idea of having a custom house builder a home yes. builder involved and it is. You know, that probably makes it uh, makes it a lot easier helps with design helps with a lot of things well and Miss Abby does all the interior design uh, I work a lot with the floor plans the layouts trying to get uh, what the customer needs to fit their lifestyle sure if they're traveling with they're traveling with kids if they're traveling just a, a couple people the thing about them uh, is everybody has their own idea how they want the, the trader built absolutely you absolutely. guys can actually design it that way it's awesome you have a hands-on company um, I don't want to say we're a small company we are we're a very intimate family-owned business. Right. Um, Miss Abby, her brother Brady runs the shop. Uh, I'm the sales manager, but it allows us to to get into more detail with our customers, spend more time with them. We're more hands-on. We are definitely not a retail organization. We leave that up to our dealer network, but we are more willing and able to work with our customers one-on-one -on -one and and provide the fine-tuning, the details that each and everyone wants. Well, do customers call you directly with their what they want done or designed, or do they go through the dealer and the dealer calls you? Or? What, what they do, we try to not take the, the dealer out of the equation. They contact dealers, get an idea of what they're looking for, and the dealer usually puts them in touch with us. Then we go through, and again, I'll go through the design phases, the floor plan, sleeping arrangements, length of trailer, all the little details they want. And then when it comes to we get the floor plan picked out and the layout finalized, then I turn it over to Miss Abby, and she comes in and does the interior design part. 
uh, the walls, ceiling, floors, countertops, tile backsplashes, all those little details. That's where she gets hands on with them to find out what kind of feel the customer wants. Yeah. Um, yeah. You know, one of the biggest things that we look at just the cabinetry, dark stain versus light stain, things like that. That's well, good. I'm glad customers can talk to you because a lot of times they, you know, they really it makes them feel better if they know that they're talking to the person who's building it. And absolutely, it, absolutely. You know, and and you know our dealers are all very educated, mm -hmm. but there are they're not going to know every detail about every color sample we have or every feature that we have. And instead of having to lose something in translation or making that extra phone call, you know, to yeah. relay information, we'll we'll sit down and visit with them one on one. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Well, thanks, Darwin. We appreciate it. It's great visiting with you, and you'll see more of these folks from Signature Living Quarters Conversions out of Nebraska. Yes, sir. <laughs> Valentine, Nebraska. <laughs> thanks for watching.